Hello everybody and welcome to Nomex Bikes video and today boys we're going to be racing at Baja Brawl 2024. This is Hearn's third iteration of this track. It was actually his first track back in 2021 when he released Baja Brawl 2020 and uh, since then he's made the 2022 version and now 2024. And this track looks amazing. It's always been a great layout. It's always been a very fun track. I had a lot of memories on 2022. I've, I've done tons of races on that track so we're going to see if we can make some good memories today. We actually raced the number one ranked player in race number two so stay tuned for that. Both races come down in the last lap so stay tuned. Hit that sub with that like button. Let's get right into the video, boys. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this track is absolutely beautiful, and we're lining up here for race number one. I'd like to do two races in this video. Um, hopefully, we can go 1-1 one, one today. Have a perfect day here at Baja Brawl 2024, but we will see. Haven't been on the game much the last couple days, but we're back better than ever. We're on the Husky. I need to get good on this bike, obviously. MX Nations is on Saturday, so really got to grind for that because I'd like to have, a, you know, a nice two motos and hopefully get Guam somewhere in the top five, maybe. I feel like that'd be kind of crazy. Um, but you never know. Every time I get off the Suzuki and get on the Husky, I'm like, damn. That's when you really know what a fast bike is, bro. Like, I love the Suzuki, but dude, it is underpowered in motocross. You hop on these Austrian bikes, and you're like, holy crap. So, this start's really important. It is a 180 to the left, so we could get absolutely punted here. I don't know if I go for it or not. I do usually get very unlucky with starts, and we're going to get very lucky today, maybe, unless this guy punts me. But no, we're going to take the lead. Almost doubled that. That's crazy. I'm going to try to just check out here. Track is fairly eroded. And uh, I've been getting weird frame issues. I'm not sure if that's the track or just my computer's been on for a while. So um, the game definitely feels kind of framey right now. But yeah, this is like my, I don't even know, third lap on the track ever. So we're going to see how this goes. But we definitely have a head start on the competition right now. Oh, and I am terrible at that section. I keep casing that. I don't, I don't know if you can really jump over it, though. I think you just have to scrub and then double. We don't need to worry about that right now. We are on the prowl, absolutely moving out front. So I'm going to have to get a little bit stanky on him. Oh, my goodness. A bit of an OJ. The scaling is definitely different from 2022. I'm 100% I'm confirming that now. Now, the layout's basically the same. But I definitely don't have that, like, muscle memory from the scaling. I don't know how similar it actually is, though. Some sections feel really similar, but some of these jumps, for whatever reason, definitely feel like they are scaled up a little bit, which would make sense because the bikes have gotten quicker. But we're going to go down and give time to the man in second here. And I... Uh, should not have done that. I don't have a ton of time on this track, but I guess it doesn't really matter because obviously I've ridden the layout before. Dude, I'm just OJing everything. Holy crap, these jump faces are really peaky. You gotta really scrub stuff down. And this E road is sketchy as hell. Forming very sharp. This guy behind me. We're actually gonna have a battle here. I'm not gonna win by 30 seconds, which is good. Because I feel like when I'm out in the lead, it's just boring. But I am having a horrible time trying to get on this racetrack right now. Holy crap. Please. Let me ride straight. Hands. Alright, hit the double. The guy in seconds on a 250. I think he went down, so we got a little bit more of a gap. Yeah, this track's definitely rough, man. It's uh, not the easiest track of all time. But uh, shout out to Hearn for making this free, man. Um, not like he really had a choice. I feel like if he made it paid, people would... Uh, he'd be in the DMs, I'm not gonna lie, because obviously we do have the previous two layouts, and it's not like this is like a brand new track. It's just kind of reskinned and rescaled a little bit. So um, I think if he did put it out for, for money, it'd be kind of... People wouldn't be too happy about that. Now, I personally probably wouldn't really care um, because at the end of the day, you buy whatever you want to buy. Like, who cares if someone puts something up for money? If you don't like it, just don't buy it, right? It's a very simple way to look at things, but uh, he's a man for the people. So, absolute W from the man. And I'm having a ton of fun so far. I'm kind of struggling now at finding the fastest lines. But these jumps, oh my god. They get you upside down. I know everyone loves that. Farm 14, Walnut. They have that same style of jump where you're just getting absolutely launched. So 
One surprise me, this is a pub lobby favorite, and the two tracks that were at the top of the server list today actually was Baja Brawl 2024, so no surprise there. I expect that to remain consistent for a while because we do not really see this quality for free very much. And the brother in second is trying to make a charge. So we do have a ways left in this race though. We have two and a half laps left. He might just burn by us, but I'm not gonna let that happen. He might be able to give me the lines too if he does pass me. We also have some lappers coming up. We gotta be careful about that. Check up there. I'll go middle right here because the inside's kind of sketchy with the e road. Dude, I'm getting so much airtime on these jumps. It's insane. Okay, don't do that. My only issue with this husky, man, is the suspension is very weird sometimes. Is quite odd coming from the Zuki, but I feel like the Zuki has like the best suspension other than like the KTM. It's kind of weird just to go to any bike from the Suzuki. Will this lapper move? We are gonna see. That yeah, looks like he's just gonna hug the inside. He's being nice. We're still getting caught, but he's not getting up to me. So we might be riding kind of slow, but not slow enough. make this interesting. Keep missing this rut, which is losing me a bunch of time. See if we can defend him. He's on a 250. This is a 250, bro? <laughs> I can't, come on. It's my first race back, but like, I don't care. This, okay, nah, this this bike setup, bro, I'm bottoming everywhere, dude. It's like that inside's meta, but I keep going middle rut because I am stuck in my ways. Middle rut here, and I'm going to blow it because the ruts are just not very steep. They're pretty, pretty mellow, so it's really easy to blow them over. I want to try to double this, but I keep like endoing off the braking bumps because of my freaking suspension. Changing setup for next race, 100%. I can't handle this. Oh, Troy. Anything but crashing. As long as I don't crash this lap, I'm happy with whichever outcome it is. Oh my god. Massive OJ. Come on, baby. Oh my goodness. I have to get this corner. Never mind, I don't have to get this corner, apparently. Roy! Oh, breaking bumps. I'm just, I can't even go through them, bro. I'm just like getting launched. This is going to be such a crazy finish, I feel like, but I feel like I'm just good at defense. I could bait him into crashing into me. That's kind of messed up, though. But sometimes you got to use tactics on people that are faster than you. Oh, you made a mistake. We do have lappers coming up here. Oh, no way. That's how I lose it. Hung up the freaking handlebar. That's why the inside is meta. Because that freaking happens. Oh my god, I did it again. Alright, well we're not going to give up. But again, as I say, first start of the lap, just don't crash. And what do you know? The Jan crashes, but he's going to crash too, and he's just going to give it to me. Well, I shouldn't say that yet. Because apparently I can't turn without dragging the freaking handlebar in 2024. Are you serious, bro? Every freaking corner. Okay. Do I get cuts? I don't think I get cuts. I don't know what happened to him. Alright. We won the freaking first race, dude. 360. 
Oh, oh. All right, boys, we're on the gate here for race number two. We joined a new server, and actually, this is my rank server. It's my rank rotation, and the number one ranked player is in this server, so I don't like my chances. Now, we did switch our suspension, so we should be a little bit better, but um, I'm just gonna have to go full send, bro. Full send, but I don't want to send it too hard. I do want to be consistent. All right, I was not happy that I crashed there on that last lap when I said I, I shouldn't do that. So we're going to try not to do that, and it's all going to come down to this start. It's very, very important in these ranked servers because the skill gap between the fastest guy and the slowest guy is huge, which is a great thing. I, I love that. I love that, you know, every type of player is getting on these servers. But once you get behind the guys that are a little bit slower, you know, at least for someone like me that, you know, it's a little bit faster, it's 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 kind of tough, and it definitely derails your, it derails your motivation to try to win the race. So we need to get a good start and uh, hopefully not get punted. It looks like we are the furthest to the inside, but we're going to get cut off and taken out. Oh, wow. My game felt like it almost crashed there. Oh, man. That is exactly what you do not want to have to happen. And I don't really know what I could have done there. I, I held the inside as much as I could, but still he cut down and took my inside out. And, of course, this guy is down right in the middle of the main line. Oh, man. So... I think right now my brain is saying we just got to get third. So until we get a third place, that is my one goal is to get to third as fast as possible. Because I don't, I don't really think after getting taken out like this, we're really going to have a chance to get any higher than that. But you never know what can happen at MX Bikes. Anything is possible. But we just can't get taken out anymore. I can only pray. To go off the track a little bit there and get around those guys. I need to start going inside there, but sticking that middle line because I'm a little bit more comfortable taking it. Find a way around this guy. You can definitely low line some of these jumps, so try to do that a little bit. It's a little bit scummy, but everyone else is gonna do it, so might as well. Okay, turn. Okay, we're kind of schmoving right now. Oh my god, I'm getting so many freaking, like, frame spikes on this freaking track, dude. What the hell's going on? Alright, we're eight seconds back, so we're actually not even that far back. Loki held it a little bit there. Oh, I keep OJing that jump. The E-Road's starting to come in. I think that's going to change the way this track rides a lot. Because the E-Road forms super sharp for some reason. Kind of glitchy. Got to worry about that a little bit, but... Now we're in sixth place. We're not doing too bad so far. Okay, these guys went down. I got to try to dodge them here. Come on, baby. Oh. Go, 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 go. Gotta keep it consistent. That's all we can really do. Oh, I freaking keep missing that line. Holy, dude, that jump sends me so high. I think you could save like an entire second if you low lined it. I think I should probably start going outside there unless I try to double it. Inside's definitely the quickest line there, but I stood up a little bit. Down to 250. It's on a gas gas. I don't recognize the bike sound. Alright, well we're in fourth. This is third right here. And so, we're actually doing pretty good. Maybe top two is possible. I mean, I feel like if I gain nine seconds to win, that'd be kind of crazy, but... Let's see what we can do here. Just the inside. I can just get a whole new freaking setup, bro. I just cannot go through braking bumps on this bike. It is not good. Get this guy on the inside here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Whoopsies. Oh, God. I don't know if he's trying to defend that or what happened. I feel like my back end got, like, caught on his bike and I got, like, pulled towards him. I'm 
But uh, inside actually felt pretty good there. I should be in third now. I honestly have no idea. Yeah, we're still we're seven seconds back. We're actually gaining a little bit of time. If hey, listen, if the leader runs into lappers here, there's actually a chance. There's actually a chance we can win, maybe. Oh no, I'm dead. No, I'm not. Oh my god, bro. Bench I'm running is so stiff. I don't know if this is the move or not. I'm not riding terrible on it, but like the corners, I feel like I can't really soak into them. It was a bit better in the bumps, though. All right, it's down to six seconds. Oh my god, I keep OJing that, bro. That jump just sends you to Narnia. Okay, this hero is getting crazy. Stuff's happening up here. I think we got some battles. Oh man, dude. I will I ever make that inside rut? My friend's just like dying. It's like gets stuck just going straight. Come on. Go. <laughs> Trying to charge. These guys are battling up in the lead. Dude, you saved so much time. <laughs> That's actually insane. Yeah, outside is definitely quicker. You can like jump into it. This position right here. I don't think it is. We'll see. I'm in fourth now. I don't know who this dude in second is, but he's moving. We gotta beat him to get top three, because I think this guy just passed me. He's gone. He's also the number one ranked player. Okay, the guy's right here. Oh, he took him out. Okay. This is huge right here. We can actually get second. No way, bro. Why do I keep OJing that? Okay, okay, he's down. Don't do it, bike. Oh my god, his bike almost went into the inside. Hey, listen to me. We've actually been catching the leader. We got down to four seconds. It's because I've been doing what I said at the start. I've been just keeping it consistent. I'm not going very fast, but... Most other dudes just be pushing a little bit too hard. Capitalize on their mistakes. Ah, uh, that's a big mistake there. I might get, like, a cut for that. I hope not. Dude, imagine the leader goes down. Just imagine. What if I get cuts for taking that low line? I have no idea. It's not like it saves you that much time anyway. Maybe even, like, maybe half a second. Maybe. Come on, suspension. Okay, can I make this corner good? Yes, we can. Come on. All right, well, we're not going to win, obviously. I think we should get second here, barring cuts. I don't know how many cuts we have. Only lost by three seconds, but... Listen, I'm pretty happy with that race, even though that start just absolutely destroyed us. 360, it's got to be a tradition at this point. Anyways, guys, we're getting a little bit better. I think we're kind of getting ready for, um, for MX Nations. I haven't been playing this game much the last couple of days. I got midterms right now, so I've just been doing a lot of homework, and I probably shouldn't even be making this video, but um, I love making videos, so it's, it's kind of hard to keep me away for more than two days. So, yeah, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next video. Peace.